So hello everybody and happy holidays if you are on holidays. Happy Christmas, Merry Christmas if you celebrate Christmas and if you are working, I'm here for you too. So it is holiday, so we need to have a little lightweight video and I have dressed up for you, <laughs> as you can see. So it cannot be a very technical video, right? Let's lighten up a little bit and I'm going to show you how you can navigate in Power BI without using the mouse. We're going to do everything with our fingers. And uh, it's a bit harder than you might think. Anyhow, I'm going to show you some shortcuts that I found that you might need at some point, but let, let's go through them. First of all, make sure that you have Power BI selected, that you are in Power BI. Now, the first one that you need to know is Control F6. If you click that, you see whatever it gets below on the screen is what has been selected. In this case, you see here. Okay, so now we have selected something, the first visual on the report. If you have it in that order, I'll show you. Control F6, moved to, you have to find the blue ones. You see the blue one there? It moved to, to the tabs. F6 to file up there. F6, move to format image, you see it there. Then it will move to fields and filters, the filter pane, and then it will move to, I don't know what it is now. <laughs> oh, it moves my name. You can click enter to see what it is. So, you know, you can log in, log out. And then F6, escape. F6, I'm stuck now. Escape is supposed to take you out of the focus, it doesn't always do it. So control F6, and I am again in the visual. So visual tab, file, format, fields, filter. And now we are on, on this, um, you'll see there. You see where we are? So escape, and we're going to do control F6 again. So we can go back to our VS view. So F6 will navigate through all the main menus in Power BI. Now, now that we have our focus here on the first visual, you can actually tab your visuals. The order of the tab will depend on what you have here in the selection tab order. So for accessibility reasons, you want to have this correctly. Now I'm, I'm on another way altogether, so there you see. Huh? So tab, 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 shift, tab, as always, will go back and tab will go forward. Voila, <laughs> you're welcome. Now, so let's back up to the filter, the slicer. Now, if you want to access within the visual, you click control, right arrow, and then it will take you inside. As you can see, we are here now. And then you can tab inside, enter, up and down, enter, you pre enter, right? So, and then if you want to get out, escape, escape. And then we can continue tapping. Now I'm in the filter. No, now I'm here. Okay, cool. Okay, good. Now let's go to the field pane because I think that that is actually the most useful. Let me go there. So control F6, uh, now I'm there, okay. And now you have to tab inside. And if you click the arrow, it will open the tables. If you click the left arrow, it will close them. So right arrow open. And now you can go to the next one, right arrow, left arrow. <laughs> cool, right? Now, um, which this? If you click Alt, Shift 9, it'll open all the tables. Alt Shift 1 will close them all. I will never ever remember that shortcut, so I'm going to give you another trick. So Alt Shift 9. Let's say that you know you, you've been around and you have all the tables open and now you want to close them. You don't have to close them one by one. Here's what I always do. I click there. And when you open it, it's closed. <laughs> It's the, the Alt Shift 9 is too, too hard for my brain. <laughs> I will never remember that. 
So those are the shortcuts that will allow you to do main navigation things in Power BI. So remember, Control F6 and then tap, tap, tap to tab inside you just, you know, tab it, the normal tab and then you're good to go. Yay! So I hope you enjoyed this video. Happy holidays again. Merry Christmas. Hope you're having a good time. If you are working, you are probably having a good time with this video. So maybe I did my job anyway. I will see you again on Friday with the Dax Riders video. So until then, take care and 